You've already seen how to enter historic data into the CRM, but what about keeping track of the things you still need to do? We offer a few different features to help with this, and the easiest one is the task list. A task is basically just a reminder that you need to do a certain thing on a certain day in the future. Right now, we're looking at my workspace. You can see my list of today's tasks in the left column. As the name suggests, this is just a list of tasks that you need to complete. Each task has a due date, and this list shows any tasks due today, plus any tasks due in the past that aren't marked as complete yet. Once I complete a task, I just check the box to indicate that it's finished. There are a variety of ways to add tasks to this list throughout the CRM, but I can always create a new task by simply mousing over calendar in the navigation bar and clicking add a new task in this dropdown. I'll start by entering a name for the task. In this case, I'll say that I need to clean my office today. Next, I'll pick what day it will be due. I'll set this to be due today. The first option in the bottom section asks me to set an assignee for this task. Later in this guide, I'll show you how to add more users to your account. If you do that and your permissions are set to allow it, you'll see this option to assign tasks to another user. If you assign it to someone other than yourself, they'll get an email letting them know about the new task. You won't see this option at all if you haven't added any users, so don't worry if you don't see it on your account. Next, I can choose to put this task on any of my calendars. I have a calendar for work items and a separate calendar for personal items, so I'll choose my personal calendar in this case. Finally, I can enter a description. This is a good place for any additional details that didn't fit in the task name, or added context if I'm assigning this to someone else. Finally, I'll click Create Task. Because I set the due date as today, it immediately shows up in today's tasks under the section for my personal calendar. If I had chosen a date in the future, it wouldn't show up here yet because the task list only shows tasks that are currently due. If you need to see future tasks, you can do that from your calendar or from a special task-specific report that you'll find under the Your Workspace menu at the top of your CRM. The task we just created is fine for remembering to clean my office, but what if I need to remember to follow up with someone, like giving them a call? In that case, I need to link the task to that contact's profile in my CRM to make it easier to find that contact later. First, I'll pull up the contact I need to call. And on their profile page, I'll click the task link on the left side to enter a task that's attached to them. This works just like creating the task we already scheduled for today, but since I'm creating this from John's contact record, it says at the bottom of the window that the task will be linked to John. I'll quickly fill in the details and save this follow-up task. Linking this task to a specific contact can be helpful in two ways. First, when you view a contact, you'll see a list of upcoming tasks for that particular person. And second, if we go back to my daily task list on the workspace, you can see that this new task has a badge that links directly to John's profile. This makes it easy to quickly jump to John's record in my database to enter notes and other information when I make that call. Now you know how to create tasks, but there's one more feature I'll show you that can come in very handy. Every morning before you wake up, if you have any tasks due that day, we'll send you an email summarizing everything on your calendar for today. In addition to tasks, this email will show your events. We'll talk about those in the next video in this guide. So when you wake up and check your email each day, your full agenda will be waiting in your inbox. It doesn't get any easier than that. Go ahead and try adding some tasks. Once you've got a follow-up or two set, come back here and move on to the next step.